for me, the most important sustainable development goal is goal number five, which is on achieving gender equality as well as empowering all women and girls. For me, it's important because there's nothing more fulfilling and more better than a society that doesn't put boundaries or limits on human rights just because this is a girl and this is a, a woman. I think we need to change what is deemed as normal when it's just simply denying another human being their rights. What is deemed as normal, it's culture, but it's simply denying young women, it, uh, women out, young women and girls their rights. So if we can create a society that favors males, I'm quite sure we can also create a society that also favors women and men both equally. Like what Shimamanda says, we should all be feminists. We can all be feminists and that means you can just stand up for the rights of the girl woman in your life. This can be your girlfriend, this can be your wife, this can be your sister. Stand up for their rights, whether it's their right to education, their right to help. Stand up for them, stand up for their opportunities and basically you've done something extraordinary. Yes, through my post as the Youth President of Zimbabwe United Nations Association, I've managed to facilitate various workshops on gender equality. This is this is targeted mainly boys, men, as well as women and girls. I've also advocated for equal representation of women, especially in universities and whatever course that they can have. As well as I have a blog that I post on issues that are affecting today's uh, uh, women today, as well as post suggested solutions to that. My blog is called Today's Woman, so you can visit it anytime.